Welcome to the Technical Studies. In this video, I will explain the 10 types of scaffoldings. Please like the video and comment. Scaffolding systems are essential in construction, providing temporary support for workers and materials. They vary in design and application to suit different structural needs and work environments. Here are the primary types of scaffolding systems. Single scaffolding or bricklow scaffolding. The structure of this scaffolding consists of a single row of standards placed parallel to the wall with ledgers and put logs supporting the platform. This type of scaffolding is ideal for brick masonry work. Spacing. Standards are spaced 2 to 2.5 meters apart with ledgers at vertical intervals of 1.2 to 1.5 meters. Double scaffolding or mason scaffolding. Structure. Features. Two rows of scaffolding for added stability. This type of scaffolding preferred for stone masonry, where wall penetration for put logs is not feasible. The components include rakers and cross braces for enhanced strength. Cantilever scaffolding or needle scaffolding. Structure. Supported by needles or horizontal beams projecting through holes in the wall. Suitable for situations where ground support is limited or unavailable. Applications. Common in bridge construction and high-rise building maintenance. Suspended scaffolding. Structure. Platform, suspended from a building's roof, using ropes or chains, allowing vertical movement. Uses. Ideal for tasks like painting, cleaning, and repairs at significant heights. Features. Platforms can be raised or lowered as needed. Trestle scaffolding. Structure. Platform is supported by movable tripods or ladders. Uses. Designed for indoor work, such as painting or repairs, up to a height of 5 meters. Advantages. Easy to assemble and dismantle, making it suitable for confined spaces. Steel scaffolding. Tube and clamp. Structure. Constructed from steel tubes, connected by clamps, forming a robust framework. Uses. Offers high strength and durability, suitable for large-scale construction projects. Benefits. Fire-resistant and capable of supporting heavy loads. Modular scaffolding systems. Types. 
include systems like cup lock, ring lock, and quick stage. Structure. Prefabricated components that interlock to form a stable scaffolding. Uses. Common in industrial and commercial projects for their ease of assembly and adaptability. Applications. Used in high-rise construction, stadiums, and bridges. Rolling scaffolding. Structure is similar to supported scaffolding, but equipped with lockable wheels for mobility. Uses. Allows easy movement across large areas, ideal for interior work such as painting and electrical repairs. Patented scaffolding. Structure. Pre-engineered scaffolding systems with specialized frames and couplings. Uses. Provides quick assembly and disassembly, often used in commercial and residential construction. Features. Adjustable platforms and enhanced safety features. Choosing the right scaffolding. Selecting the appropriate scaffolding system depends on factors like the type of construction, height requirements, ground conditions, and the nature of the work to be performed. It's essential to assess these factors to ensure safety and efficiency on the construction site. Thank you for watching.